everybody. Matthew and Shannon back with you here. We're getting ready to start our first cuts, cutting our parts off our trees here. I've got mine, my first my engine parts. Now we're getting Chan's. She's getting ready to cut her parts. So here we go. Okay, how do you really? We got one cut. Oh. There's a part! Right there! Part! <laughs> I can see a lot of people aren't going to watch this. Yeah. But we don't care. We're having fun. Two parts! Okay, two parts! Yay! Oh. Alright, we'll be back in a minute. Okay, so now you can see we have parts put together ready for painting. This is my motor half. A couple parts. And this is whoop, Shannon's motor half. And a couple parts. And she actually cleaned hers up better than I did. So we're going to get started painting. And we'll show you that here in a minute. Badger, where is that? There it is. Badger does such a good job. That makes me guys sick. So that's paint going on the motor. I'll paint. No, just take some more. Gold, by the way, that's what they looked it up online. They say gold murders, so gold, genuine imitation, fake. <laughs> and we're back when we get some house. Hey, everybody, this is Shannon, just giving you a quick little update. Here are our engines so far. And Matthew's is on the left and mine is on the right. We have a little system going where we cut and we sand and then we attach to little prongs or whatever these things are so we can then paint. I didn't realize there were this many pieces to one engine. So I'm learning something new. But so far it's been pretty fun. Here are all my pieces ready to go. And we've had to color coordinate because we keep missing who's who's. So we've put little red marks on all my pieces and leave Matt's blank. So that's it so far. Okay, everybody, we're back again. Here's where we're at so far. This is my motor that's where we're at with it so far we're doing uh, just box stock since this is Shannon's first time so we're both doing the same thing and something cool I found is right here 
they have a simulated flywheel. See that? So you can have a little flywheel there if you want. I didn't paint it, but if you want to, it's not going to be seen. But I thought that was kind of cool. And here is Shannon's motor. And I will say, everything that's been done on this motor, she has done. I have not touched it. You can see it looks as every bit as good as mine, not better. Touched it now. Well, I'm touching it now, yes. I'm holding it. <laughs> But from cutting the parts off the trees, cleaning the parts, painting the parts, everything she's done. All she's doing is just kind of watching me doing the same thing. So I think she's done a tremendous job here. I say tremendous a lot. Okay. Why? I don't know. Awesome job. She's doing an awesome job. So that's where we're at for now, and we will be back shortly. Alright, this is how my wife chooses to drive parts. <laughs> She says, it works. Just hold the air dryer on let it spin. <laughs> Is that funny or what? Hey everybody, it's Shannon. We're done with two motors today. We started at what time? 10. 10. And it's now 8.30. And we use this picture to go by. And here are our motors. Looks like ladies first, so here's mine. And I did do everything. Well, except for this tiny, tiny little piece right there. Oops, there. Because I couldn't get it in. And I have a feeling I was going to break it, so may I put it in for me? But the rest of it, I did everything. There's mine, and here's Matt's. Looks pretty similar. Pretty much identical. Anything else you want to say? No, just you've done as good job as I did. Alright, well, that's it for today. End of day one. You guys have a great night. Toodaloo! Toodaloo!